A Vietnam veteran's widow and her family will no longer have to park their family's vehicle outside. Uh, Josh Peterson found that thanks to a grant program, a family that was in need got a helping hand. After the passing of Vietnam veteran and father, this family struggled. Now, a simple 20 by 24 foot garage is a dream come true due to the help and leadership of a family friend. This family and other area businesses worked together to make this dream of a garage reality. The Home Depot Foundation recently awarded $12,000 in grant money to the family to help get this construction project off the ground. Her husband was a friend of mine. He passed away in 1999. He was a Vietnam veteran, so that I thought maybe that would qualify her for the program. So with the Disabled American Veterans and the Legion and the VFW's help, we put in a grant and it was approved. With help from area businesses and thanks to local associates, this Team Depot project got off the ground. The construction project is part of a larger initiative by Home Depot. Over the next five years, Home Depot plans on spending up to $80 million nationally to help those in need. Really the goal is to make sure that everyone has a safe, a safe place to live. And I think this is you know, really a nice example of, of, of part of that program. For this family, it was the father's wish that this family would not only someday have a home, but a sense of security. Security and to take care of others and help others, and which we always do. So, After 13 years of filing appeals for veterans' widow pensions, the legacy of a father not only includes a home, but now a garage. In Bemidji, I'm Josh Peterson, Lakeland News. All the materials for the project were donated by Home Depot, Siegmiller Services, Knife River Concrete, and various veterans groups. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.